Amanza Smith had a terrifying brush with death earlier this year after contracting a bone infection that left her hospitalized at Cedars Sinia Medical Center in Los Angeles. The Selling Sunset star revealed the doctors told her she was one or two days away from dying just before she received treatment. The interior designer ordeal, which lasted nearly a month, was diagnosed as vertebral osteomyelitis following tests and an MRI scan. One or two more days at home and you could have been dead, Smith's doctor told her later. Smith told People, I thought I had a backache, and I almost died. The doctors and my friends saved my life. Back in June, Smith took to social media to share an insight into her pain following her spine surgery with a video that saw her using a walker. Smith also included a clip of herself getting a scan, which she admitted she prays will return clear so she can finally be discharged. Other parts of the video showed snaps of Smith laying in her hospital bed, with one of the pictures showing her looking sad and flashing a thumbs down. In the caption, Smith wrote, Getting stronger and can walk with a walker to the restroom and around the room a bit when my pain meds are allowing me to do so. Once we just get this pain under control I can possibly go home. Pray that this last scan is clear and this girl can possibly go home soon. Day 23 and ready to get out of here. Thank you for all the continued thoughts and prayers, the Netflix star added. The procedure took place on Friday 16th of June after the infection, called osteomyelitis, ravaged part of her spine and caused it to completely deteriorate. In a post shared after the first part of the surgery, Smith wrote on Instagram, I'll be getting a new vertebrae and a couple of screws and rods in my spine to replace what has been eaten away from the bacteria.